Hello everyone and welcome to the 5th episode of the Bournemouth career mode. We are currently in January where you can help me uh, comment down below and you know suggest some brilliant players but it's not, well this is not why I'm going to be, uh, how can I say this, I'm speaking to you now because one, uh, my intro uh, got cut off during the recording, two, I just want to say a big thank you to the ones that did turn up uh, in my live stream on the fourth episode of the career mode. It was a three hour long live stream. If you can watch bits back at it, there's you know things that you've missed that we are currently on top of the table unbeaten so far and um, hopefully that'll you know keep it up and hopefully we can go ahead and get back into the promised land, the Premier League. Uh, but yeah, again, this is just to say thank you very much to everyone. It's been amazing recording this because I've really enjoyed it, and I've enjoyed having you know the company of everyone coming into the live stream. It's really been very supportive, and um, I hope everyone is having a lovely day. And uh, thank you for clicking on this video if you are new. Then please subscribe and give a like on the video. That'd be very appreciative and it can also boost my motivation up so I can continue doing these because I am really busy constantly and normally I wouldn't have time to go ahead and make videos like this but I am doing my best for you guys so yeah again I just want to say thank you very much uh, for you know tuning in and I'm gonna let the video play uh, so you can watch what happens in episode 5 so take care everyone for window but for now we're going to be focusing on this career mode and we have not a busy month we have you know five games to play and uh, I'm only going to be playing two of them which is going to be Brentford and I'm also going to be playing against Cardiff so uh, we do have the um, was it the EFL Cup we're going to be playing well not yes yeah, yeah, Emirates FA Cup. Uh, uh, we have against Oxford United in the round in the third round. Uh, I'm not going to be playing that game. Uh, I do have players going to be saying they they want to play that game, but I'm just going to sim this one. I'm just going to like. Right, he says he wants to play. Well, we'll let Faith decide that because I'm going to be uh, doing this, and then see if we get a win here against Oxford. We should. Come on. Anytime would be nice. It's a one 0 win. Happy days. Uh but having a look at us having a look at us uh in the table. Sixty seven points and we have an eight point difference against Watford. And we're unbeaten as well, which is unbelievable scenes right there. Uh, let's have a look at the rest of the table. So top six look pretty good. Uh, potential contenders of getting up in the Premier League and looking down at the table Barnsley, Rotherham and Coventry so we have five bits in the uh, in the email department who uh, Walsall Jack Scrimshaw has uh, came back from his loan and so has Kyle Taylor and Rick Helmy's appearances. Uh, I wanted to let you know Atletico Madrid have been in touch. They are apparently unhappy with how little playing time uh, Rodrigo Rick Helmy has been. Okay, so they're just unhappy that I've been using. Ah, uh, I did it. Okay, well, I have to rotate the squad. I didn't. And uh, Adam Smith is unhappy with his play time. He's someone I'm looking to get rid of uh, next season as well. So. If he goes, he goes, I guess, but for now, we are going to play against Brentford, who are currently sitting in the top six, I believe, uh, if we go ahead and sim all the way to the Brentford game, and stop. They currently sit in fourth, which is quite a strong position for them, and we have players. Uh, oh, Vakelmi has been recalled by Atletico. Okay, so, so okay, so he's out of the club completely. Wow. Okay, that's something new I didn't expect. Uh, that's the first time it's ever happened to me, actually. Uh, but if you didn't know, in the live stream, I did sign one player, and that player was this Coleman, Florian Coleman. 
he has been doing absolutely amazing for me and I'm happy that uh, the person that suggested this, Lucas, uh, if he is watching this, thank you for suggesting him to me. He's been outstandingly well in this career mode. So I am going to reshuffle the team against... Uh, yeah, I'm going to reshuffle the team real quick and I'll get right back to you. Alright everyone, so this is the team as you can see. We have Begovic in goal, right back is Smith, left back is Rico, centre backs we have Cook and Mepham, the DMs we have Lerma and Billy in the strong defensive midfields, uh, the wingers we have Coleman and Brooks, at Cam we have Cook and up front we have Josh King, who I believe is top goal scorer with 20 goals which is outstanding to see. So we are going to get right into this Brentford game and hope for a good result. Guard, no guard, the Silva. Oh, that's a good pass to Ivan Tony. Ooh, that was a dangerous start there. Shrugged off easily from Ivan Tony. Chris Mepham should be doing way better than that. Ivan Tony gets his tenth goal of the season. Alright, we've got some work to do. We still got it. Oh, come on, Coleman, you could have done better than that. It's now to Cook. He's in open space. Come on, Cook. Come on, go, 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 go. That's it. Lewis Cook. Backs himself a goal as well. 18 minutes in. Lewis Cook is unbelievably slow. But I'm going to take it. Uh, gets his seventh goal, which is actually pretty impressive. That's cleared away. It's good. It's a good clearance. Brentford are strong on the ball, trying to get the. Oh, good save, Asmir. Henry might whip that in. Nope. It's in the centre of the box. Block it. That's a good block from Rico. Didn't get the ball though. We're getting absolutely dominated by Brentford. Come on, Coleman, you've got the pace, you've got the pace, you've got the pace, you've got the burners. Did really well there. Oh, no, 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 no. He's missed it from, oh, it was so open. It's a good pass back. Dribble pass, dribble pass, dribble pass. I can't get it from Lerma. It's a good save that from Azmir Begovic. It's Cook. Come on, Cook. Come on, Cook. Come on, Cook. What a save from David Raya. Ivan Tony is open. That might be a. Oh, it's not a free kick, thankfully. Oh no. This could be bad. Cook, run back to your position mate, come on Jefferson, yes, right Coleman, you've got the pace to beat him, you've got the pace, to, the pace, you got the pace, you got the pace, come on go, 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 slice it, yes, Florian Corm Coleman gets himself, I think goal number five of the season, Yes, mate! Smith row. Oh, trying to pass that back to Smith. Ivan Tony's got the ball. Yes, met him. Got him this time. There's Coleman again. Come on, Coleman. Oh, no! That could have been three. I could have wrapped up the game. Down there. Smith Rowe, I can see you running. It's 
just whip this in for Dominic. Nope, it's not going to go to him. Three minutes added on. They might have a last attack here. Come on, get the ball, get the ball, get the ball, get the ball. Switch to the right players, please. You've got that one. Yes. Nope. Yes. Get it away. Yes. 2 1. Happy days. It's another win for us. Oh god, what's Steve Cook saying? Hi boss, I'm not one to complain or say I'm unhappy at the, the club, but I'm worried that this transfer window is almost over now and we don't look like we've brought in the players we need to strike. We're already good enough. I mean, eh, what do you mean? Speaking of uh, Cook, is this Lewis or is it... It is Lewis and Sheffield United want him and I'm not looking to get rid of him. Right, next game is going to be against Luton and I am not going to be playing this one. I'm only going to sim the match and see who is going to come out on top. I'm not going to be jumping into games anymore from, uh, from quick sim. I'm just going to, you know, watch and see if we do end up with a great result. Now I do notice that this feature is broken but I have my faith in this, I'm not going to lie, I do have faith that, you know, we get a result that we want. Oh, this is the tester, oh, Collins gets himself a goal, goes past Begovic easily. Billing, oh, Coleman was really close of getting that one in. That wasn't a good pass from Smith oh, we nearly conceded again it's 2-0 Morel gets himself a goal as well I am going to take off Smith because I feel like he's the reason why we are doing appalling in this game so I'm going to take him off uh, who else can I put on? Coleman's doing well on the left. I'll give him that. I think I'll take off Solanke and put on King. And uh, I'll leave it at that. There we go. Billing all the way out to Brooks. Come on. Come on, Brooks. There we go. Gotta go back. Say, say. Yes. Billing! What's he done? Yes, we got it back. Nice. Some good passing. That's going to be offside. This might be our first L. Probably is going to be our first L. It's going to be a corner. Last minutes of the game. There we go. It's our first loss of the series. It's against Luton Town. Oh. We have Brighton. Ooh. Cardiff might be in sixth. But I am more than happy to sim this Cardiff game and play the Brighton game. Let's have a look at their team. Smithies, Bakuna, Bamba, Morrison, Cunningham, Pack, Volks, Wilson, Murphy, Tomlin and Moore. That's a good start. That is a really good start. Josh King getting himself his 21st goal in the championship. Got a throw in, but that can mean absolutely anything. Oh, they're through, they're through. Moore's got himself a goal. Ah, uh, no. That's not good. Oh, he's through. Come on, Coleman. Come on, Coleman. Come on, Coleman. Yes, Coleman. Come on, getting his sixth goal. Cardiff are in. It's 2 2. Muir's got himself another one. Clear it. 2 2. I mean, I'll take it. It's a draw. It's a point. Cook has come back to me. He's always been talking to me. What's he been saying now? Hi boss, I just wanted to want to know how things stand. I thought you were going to think about bringing in new faces. The team 
lack of transfer activity it could be damaging the team could uh let's see I've got a lot to think yeah I've got a lot to think about okay maybe we do need to bring in someone maybe a new right back because Adam Smith he's not gonna be staying here for long I'll tell you that much he's probably gonna be leaving either now or next season because I am not enjoying how he's playing right now I mean yeah I might as well just stick with this team I mean it looks pretty decent as it is I mean got Begovic in goal, Stacey and Rico at the full backs, Cook and Mepim as the centre backs, Lerma and Billing as the DMs, Dan Juma and Brooks as the wingers, Coleman at Cam and King up front. You can't go wrong with it, I mean I like the team as it is but like I said a new right back would be nice and John Joe Kenny has recently transferred so that means my only option here if I were to get a new right back is Timothy Fosu Mensa. I don't think I have any other right backs do I? No I don't. It's only Fosu Mensa. Alex Tawanzabe though can play at the right back. I noticed that. And I stop blathering. That's going to be the team we're going to be up against Brighton and let's see if we win. Juma. Can he bend this one in? No. Wrong foot to take it with. Ah, but gives it away very awfully. Come on. Oh, it's a save from Asmir Begovic. And I could not switch to the player I wanted to switch. It's a good pass. I can't switch them. I couldn't switch to... I think it was Rico. I could not switch to him. The only players I could switch to were the players far away from him. Yes, Coleman. That's a beautiful pass. And that's a beautiful goal. In the nick of time. The 87th minute. That's what we wanted. Come on. What a run from Coleman. That was so needed. And uh, I'll keep Coleman on. Just in case we go into the next, uh, the next round. I've just tackled my own player. There we go. Come on. Go, go, get that. Damn it, Lamptey. that way I tackled my own player that's not clever of me okay, so it goes on to a replay okay it'll go on to a replay that's fine we are approaching the end of the episode it has been a fun episode uh, we will be doing a live stream uh, in my next form of save I don't know when it will be but it should be very soon uh, I'm actually gonna sim this completely all the way to the um, the last day. See if we can pick up a win against Huddersfield because I just want to get this over and done with because I've got bits to do. It's a 2-1 victory which I'm very happy with. We are now on deadline day and do we have anything up? Joshua King saying he's thanking me uh, for the first team uh, thingy. Okay and uh, Lewis Cook says hey boss I know uh, people have been talking about the position you're playing me in. Oh, okay, so it must have changed his position when he was playing against uh, Huddersfield. And then uh, Adam Smith says thanks. It's not really that brilliant. I'm going to have to be honest. I might get rid of him. It, I don't know. We'll see you on my live stream when it does come out. But right now we are on the deadline day and I'm going to be ending it here. So thank you very much for watching. If you did enjoy, please give it a like and please subscribe if you're new around here. That would really mean a lot to me. And um, I shall see you guys in the next episode of whatever I'm doing. Take care.